Men don't need hormones. We're perfect. God made us perfect. Uh, every woman in the world will disagree with that, and I understand. But most guys are too macho or egotistical to think or understand that we also need hormones and that we lose hormones as we get older. Well, I'm here to tell you, don't fight it. There's a multitude of clinics out there that are advertising testosterone replacement, hormones for men, in order to improve sexual function, libido, erectile function, orgasmic ability, metabolism, fat burning, cholesterol burning, strength, energy, etc. Because when we lose our testosterone, even though it may be normal for your age, it's not the same level of testosterone that you had when you were 20. And most doctors don't conceptualize that because when we look at a lab test, this is normal. And so normal for a 20 year old is blended together with normal for an 80 year old. And if your level is down here, we say, well, that's still normal. But it's not where you were when you were younger, which is up here. There's a difference between normal and optimal. That's where you need to be. Most doctors don't understand or grasp that. If you go to your doctor and ask them for it, they'll say, no, your lab test is fine. You don't need it. But what about my symptoms? Well, we don't treat your symptoms. We just treat the numbers. Well, unfortunately, the physicians are typically not trained on how to do this. If you go to your physician and you run up against a brick wall because they don't know or understand it, and if a doctor's not up on it, they're down on it, they won't be up on it, they'll be down on it because they don't know what to do or how to do it, then you need to come to the WorldLink site and look up a physician that's been trained adequately that can prescribe hormones and improve your quality of life and improve your health and your wellness. Some doctors, your PMDs, will actually prescribe these commercial available products like Androgel. It's a 1% cream. We prescribe 20% cream, which is 20 times the 1%. Many men on the 1% cream don't see any benefit or any improvement in their symptoms because the dose is so small. And the key here is to understand normal is not optimal. We optimize your levels based on lab test and based on symptom improvement. We're trained to optimize your testosterone. Until you get your testosterone levels optimal, you will not feel and function as you did before. And you'll still be tired, fatigued, gaining fat, gaining weight, losing muscle, unable to feel or function as you once did. The number one symptom that we tend to see in men when they lose testosterone is a sexual dysfunction. And what that means is weakness of erections, not length or strength of erections that you used to have, or the ability to maintain erections for a long period of time, like we used to be able to have. You can regain that with testosterone. So for sexual dysfunction, there is nothing else that helps improve libido. That's sexual desire, as well as sexual function, and of course, as sexual performance. Mm -hmm. There's health benefits to lowering cholesterol, to lowering blood sugar, to lowering visceral fat. There's a multitude of metabolic benefits to optimizing your testosterone, in addition to the sexual benefits that most men want to receive. So if you understand and you read the literature that we have, on all the studies showing significant benefits to your long-term health and wellness, in addition to how you perform and function on a daily basis in your work and in your job and in your activities, as well as how you function as far as exercise and endurance is concerned, there's only one thing that helps improve all of those symptoms, and that's optimizing your testosterone. There's other hormones for men also, we prescribe DHEA, which is another hormone that has anabolic health benefits. We also optimize thyroid, if your thyroid level is low, to help, help improve metabolism, fat burning, fat distribution, subcutaneous fat, blood sugar elevation, cholesterol elevation. All of these hormones have metabolic effects that will lower those cardiovascular risk markers that the doctors typically will measure. For those men that are on medications for cholesterol and blood sugar and high blood pressure, you can frequently come off of those medications once we get the visceral and the subcutaneous fat down with the hormones because you won't have those problems anymore because we've eliminated that visceral fat that's adding on to those diseases. So women need hormones, but men need hormones too. Don't fear them, but please don't expect your physicians to know and understand all of the complexities in prescribing, monitoring, and adjusting 
your male hormones. Come see one of the practitioners on the WorldLink site. They're all expert trained clinicians on how to prescribe, monitor, and adjust hormones for both men and women. And remember, hormone replacement is a team sport.